Hello everybody, and today we're going to talk about the best new way to start programming video games. So GameMaker Studio 2 is a great engine to program video games in, and it's had a free license basically that you can, or a free trial that you can use, but the thing is that limits how many resources you can use, and you can actually play your games that you make of course, but the thing is you can't release your games onto any platform. And what I mean by that is you can't make an actual executable file that allows you to play your video game. You can only play it by going into Game Maker Studio 2 and then playing it from there. So Game Maker Studio 2, or I should say, YoYo Games, the company that made that engine, actually created something called like a creator license. And this creator license is a great deal for people who have programmed a little bit and are ready to actually make a full video game or want to make a full video game and want to release it to people. So yeah, the free trial is only for people who are kind of testing out if they even want to start programming a video game in Game Maker Studio 2. And Game Maker Studio 2 is really a good engine because it's built from the ground up for video games, though you can use it for other stuff. It's mostly for video games and it's overall basically a great programming engine. So with the creator license you spend $40 and you get it for one year and you can actually buy it to make games for desktop or Mac. So when you buy the license you can actually pick one of those two. Now that doesn't mean that when you buy it you can only use Game Maker Studio 2 on desktop or Mac it just means that you can only export a game that you make to one of those, so don't get confused by that. And buy the Mac one because you have a Mac when you actually want to make games for desktops or something like that. Don't get confused by that. So it's a great option for you. And then once that year is up or whatever, if you still are like, well, I still want to make games and everything, then you can just go ahead and upgrade to the full desktop version and you'll get a reduced price because you've already bought that and it's just a great deal all around because then you can get the desktop or the full desktop license and then you can buy other licenses such as HTML5 so you can release your game on the internet and people can play like your game online with and it's n like no hassle on your part because basically Game Maker does all that stuff for you and you can basically release your game anywhere and if your game becomes super popular or something then you can buy the Xbox One license or the PlayStation 4 license and then you can release your game this there, and it's still, it's still, like, you barely have to do any work. Game Maker handles all the hard stuff. Of course, you have to have controller support and everything, but uh, Game Maker Studio basically has it set up, so you don't really need to do that messy sort of work to get it to work. But the creator license is basically a great choice, and it's only $40. You can probably spend that cost less than a big video game, you know, and then you can start making your own games, and yeah, it'll be, it should be very good for you guys, so thank you for watching, and you should definitely think about buying that.